Hey there, YouTube. This is That Smirking Cat again for another episode of The Last Tinker. Uh, so we're, we're trying to help out this area and oh god no, it's that fucking... It's that fucking guy. Uh, oh yeah, I can bring him down here. Hooray. Be careful, the color red makes him explode. Why would I want to do that? No, I'm serious. Why the fuck would I want to do that? I want to kill him? I mean, is that kind of fucked up? I'm... Okay. You stay there while I throw something at you and make you explode. Okay, okay, good. He didn't, like, explode, explode. You get there. Hooray! Uh-oh. Wow, that's creepy as shit. Da, 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 da. Make in progress. Come here so I can make you make explosions. Woo! You know, it's kind of nice that they brought back the, the little mushroom guy. Oh my god! Did you just do that? Look, I like exploded on them. I mean, I know that's. Alright. Here, get over here. How the fuck is it different? Here's like five feet difference. Yeah, I got a brush. Alright. Well, I'm gonna bring him over here and, and fuck you guys. They're waiting on me. Yeah. Oh, no. That's not the right thing. There you go, buddy. Clear the path with the bomber. <laughs> B17 bomber. Whoa, there's a big dude. I wasn't even paying attention. <laughs> well, I am not like even doing anything clever with my attacks. I'm just slamming on that square button. Oh, what the fuck is going on here? God, it's fucking... Stay out of this, kid. Hey, faces between me and Brick. You know what? Maybe you and Brick should shut the fuck up. Just hear him too so we can get to work. Don't listen to him. Oh, he's supposed to do break things. This is riveting, really. I mean, I am, I am invested 100%. Come on. We need loot to hammer. Are are they? Are they fighting over who could work better? I'm I'm sorry. Did I miss something? Well, that happens. Boots and fast. She's what is that? Your odds are everyone's the hammers. Wow, I, I'm really confused here. So, what? Are they implying that white spirit, like, is. Why can't I go? What? Why would they not letting me go? Keep building the boats. I gotta go punch things. That's all I'm good for. Yay, it did it. Oh, 
No, I just have him sit in that paint and do nothing. Fuck off, fuck off, fuck off. Oh my god, so much repetitive button mashing. I mean, you can't expect every game to be have like really fun combat like Devil May Cry, but I mean, I would expect a little variety. Maybe I'm just being too overcritical. Why would you fucking die? Am I lost or something? Or do they purposely just make that character like really hard? Okay. There's so many of them! Ha! I bet we're not done yet. We'll see how you fight against them. Courage is inspiring. I felt like I'm Frankish! I love this guy. Is it gauge from your health bar? You can fill it by punching enemies or collecting power dust. Please, you can use my power. It will stay active until the meter is depleted. Now, I'm going to trigger my rage power! Oh, I'm like, I'm stronger. Okay, I get it now. Look at me go. I'm punching. What's that, you guys? So, hey, where'd they go? Don't tell me they left us. Oh, they did it. They built a boat. Congratulations. Uh, that's some very steady boats there. <laughs> no water physics for those. You know, they are made of cardboard, so when they just kind of, you know, become soggy and fall apart. What? <laughs> okay. Well, thank goodness that the sun was watching over us and did nothing. You know, if he's so fucking conserved, maybe he can come down and help us. You know, like the sun in Mario 3. That would be nice. Everything is cool! Except for the fact that that's still there. <laughs> well, thank goodness the music is so happy! Would you go and explore for a while? I'll go see an old friend who's running things around here. You should drop by when you're ready! Okay, so essentially they've established this is a HUD. I mean... I'm not crazy. Because it's really, really fucking obvious. It's like, this is gonna be your HUD, because everything is peaceful here, and everything is cool. Hey, Greens, don't worry, I'm not scary. It's like, yeah, if you fucking yell them, maybe they might be a little bit un uneasy. Whoa. Can I not? Oh, that's... That's weird. The crystal's there. I'm assuming I need the, the green power to... To... Get to that, but... I guess that's... That's for a later time. Hello, paintbrush. Da, 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 da. Gotta go exploring. Well, let's see what's in the blue area. We'll, we'll check out blues. Because honestly, I kind of want to see what the, the blue world's going to be like. What the blues about to turn up? There's like a natural disaster where like people died. And you're like, man, they just haven't shown up. Hello, my little monkey friend. My name is Rob Boss. Welcome to my Happy Colors Atelier. The timing is magnificent. I have a very troubling man that needs attending to, and you're just the person to help me. You see, not only am I the finest painter in Color Town, or dare I say in all of Tinker World, I am also an esteemed collector of brushes. My latest objects and I are gold floaty brushes. You must have seen them, they're scattered across the city. People think they're mere trinkets, but oh, I know their true value. The way they move conjures up a hundred happy little accidents. Painting like that is pure joy. I must possess them all. Local gossip suggests you're the only person capable of roaming the city right now. I therefore suggest a partnership. 
You deliver me all the floating brushes you can find, and I'll offer you the finest paintings in my collection in exchange. Not a bad deal, eh? <laughs> now, I, I know that that was more of like a, a Bob Ross. Ooh, concept art. I, I really enjoy concept art. Big head mode? What is this, a fucking game from the 90s? Small head mode, switched color mode, mirrored world mode, god mode, god mode. All right then. Well, since I've met such a very lovely character, I think I'm going to call it quits for this episode. But as always, like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you on the next episode. This is That Smirking Cat, signing off.